Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a um, text label that changes color. As you can see here, it is actually looping between seven colors and actually like fading through it. And it's really cool. So if you guys are excited for this video, leave a like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload. And join the group because... At the end of the month, I'm doing the giveaway, and there's only, I think, like, three more days, or four, uh, two, two to four days until, I'm, I'm bad at memorizing month, 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 right, you can't talk, alright, um, and, yeah, so, join that, join the group, Discord, and see you in the video. Also, guys, I forgot to mention, some of you guys have been claiming you have trouble, I'm seeing a video, so I will actually have a model in the description for this. So, bye. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is actually create our um, our text. So, we are going. I'm just going to add in a text label to start. Do you want it? Uh, oh, no, I need to add a screen to live first. Sorry. Alright, I'm just going to rename this for... I'm just going to rename this to vid. Or this for the vid. Alright, and then I'm going to add the text label. Um, so I'm just creating my text label right now. I'm going to set the offset of it to zero. Alright, there we go. Um, I'm just going to do 0 0.50, comma, 0, comma, 0 0.2, comma, 0. No, it's not going to work. I'm stupid. Alright. 0 0.0, 0, .0 hopefully. Alright, no, that's too small. Alright, never mind. I'm just going to resize it myself. Um, and I'm just going to put it right over there, and I'll just set the text to, um, subscribe, make sure to subscribe right now, and also I will, oops, um, also I will set, um, background transparency to one, um, oops, and I'll set the font to Gotham Black, because that's my favorite, if I can find it anywhere okay where did it go I can't find it oh it's right up here alright so I have got some black here and <clears throat> alright so I will then yeah that's pretty much it so there's my text um besides so that you're going to go ahead and add in a script and the first thing we're going to do is create a table uh, this table is going to contain all the colors that we want to rotate the text through. So, we're just going to do local CT for color table. I just do color table is equal to, and then you can go ahead and put some brackets. And if you want, you could just list all the colors like here. Let's just say, or don't type what I'm saying, I'm just showing you, and then you'll do color two blah 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 and they'll t and it's very unorganized like that so for me I'm just going to go down like this and it's still on the table alright so first of all our first color we're going to do color 3 dot from RGB I already have some colors set up for us guys um if you wanted to uh, how do I move this get out the way all right, you can actually like click right here, and you can set the color to whatever you want it to be. Um, but that would take like forever. Um, and so I already have some colors to set up a rainbow for us. So we're going to do two five four, comma zero comma zero. So that's the first one, and then you can just um, you do a comma after it. Oh no, you all do a comma, you do this, and then let's copy and paste it, uh, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, seven colors, six, seven, and right here it would be, oh, okay, uh, alright, there you go, so, but now I'm just going to reset it, so two, five, five this time, and then one two seven 
And then we're going to do, let's keep that there. And then also right here, we're going to do 255, five, um, 221, two, and 1 this time. Alright, and then right here, we are going to do 0, comma, 200, comma, oh no, yeah, there, comma, 200, comma, 0. And then right here, we would actually, right here, we'll do 0, comma, 160, comma, 199. Right here, we would do 0, comma, 55. Five, and then comma 230 and then lastly right here we would do 129 comma 16 and that dot 16 comma 16 and then comma 210 um, alright there we go so we have our seven colors that we are going to loop through um, in the script so we have created our table and now we're going to create a tween service because actually just to make it near put it put that down there. Alright, there we go. Now to make our tween service. Well basically what tween service is, if you don't know it, it's basically like an animation service, like to make stuff move or to make things transition smoothly. And in our case, it will make the colors um change smoothly, like actually going um, green to yellow. Oh, uh, you'll just see, okay? So, we'll just, let's do local info equals the tween info dot new. And we're going to do 0 0.2, comma, enum, um, enum dot easing style. So it's basically like smooth transition dot line here. Oh no, I think. Yeah, alright, that line here, comma, you know, dot easing direction. Right. You know, dot easing direction. And then we're going to do dot in out, comma, zero, comma, false. And then we're just going to do another comma and zero. So that is basically. The tween, that's the tween info. So we're going to do script dot parent dot um uh text color. And if you were doing like an image, you could do like image color, or you could even do background color and stuff. But since this is an image, I'm going to do uh, text color. Uh, and then I'll do equals to color table. Um, and we're going to get the first color. Um, no, we're going to do square brackets and then get the first color. All right, so one, and then we can do i is equal to one, and then we're going to create a loop. So while true, we're going to do um, local. We're going to create a, a variable for a tween. So local tween will be equal to game colon get service and we're going to get the tween service and they're going to do we're going to create our tween so create colon create um and we're going to do script dot parent comma info and then after that we can actually we're going to like um all right so right here Outside this, okay. No, actually, in this. All right, we're going to create a pointy bracket. I'm sorry, I'm just got confused. All right, and then we'll just do um, text color. All right, no. I'm going to do text color three. What happened to this over here? Oh, I was in the wrong thing. All right. Text color three. Um, sorry, I just got confused a little bit. Um, text. All right, text color three equals two. R. And then, oh no, we're just square brackets. R. What do you mean? Text color three 
is equal to square bracket. Oh no. I. I don't know where you got R from. Alright. I'm going to do. I don't know. Alright, I messed up again. I'm sorry, guys. I'm confused. Alright. It's a long script and it's hard to memorize. Alright. Uh, so we're going to do actually color table and one. And I. Okay. There we go. Alright, and then we're going to play the tween. So tween. Tween. Colon play. Alright, um, and now we're going to do, we're going to repeat, repeat, uh, wait, and then until, so we're going to keep waiting until, uh, the tween, um, dot is completed. So we're going to do, repeat, wait until tween dot completed, and then we're going to do wait. 0.1, a very small weight, and we're going to do um, if i is equal to equal, 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 hashtag color table, then we're going to do um, to i equals 1, so that means if it's completed the entire thing, um, if it's gone through all the colors, we're going to set i to 1, and else, if it's not, we're going to do i equals to i plus 1. Alright. I know, very confusing script. But now, I think we're done. Hopefully it works. Alright, let's see. Uh, nothing's happening. Alright, what went wrong now? Queen info that new. Third argument expects enum. And using direction input, what? Right, let's see. Alright, it does say, you know, that using style, style dot linear. Hmm. And then, and out, come with you. Oh, wait. Wait, never mind. Yeah, I don't know why this didn't work. Green info dot new. Right, guys. Oh no. Oh, it's right here. Okay. I put a comma instead of a dot. You guys probably realize that, and you're probably like yelling at me from behind your computer or phone, wherever you're watching from. And we have another problem. So it's a call between info value. What? All right. Reset. I. Alright. Hmm. Alright guys, I'm going to figure this out and I'm going to be back. Alright guys, I figured it out. You're supposed to put a comma after info. Again, a really, really small mistake. Um, but now if we go and just play it now. There we go guys, it is now changing color. So, if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more like this, um, leave a like and subscribe, hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload. Also, join the group because March is almost over and the giveaway is going to be done soon. Yes, so I rip, rip my Robux, rip a hundred of my Robux. Join the group to enter the giveaway, join the Discord, and it's an Android. And see you guys later. Bye.